Um, so I am realizing that I am gonna jump out of the plane right now, and I don't know why I thought this was a good idea before, but like right now, like this is where like I, I'm. Life's getting real. I got the things dropped to my arm. It's gonna be a lot of fun, and I'm super excited. So I hope you guys enjoy. All right, here's hey, heaven. Bam. About to make your first skydive. Five, first skydive. I am super excited. I am. I've parasailed before, but this is a completely new experience where um, going out of the plane, uh, at least I'm strapped to somebody else that knows what they're doing, so I'm very happy about that. Is it a special occasion? I'm uh, about to embark on a journey in life where, you know, I'm, I'm taking a little break from work and just uh, seeing what the world has for me. Any, any words you want to say before you jump out of an airplane? Oh, you know, um, <sighs> Oh, when you put it like that, come on, like thoughts makes it sound like it's such a temporary thing. No, absolutely not. No, I, I mean, it's, uh, it's one of those things that I am, uh, I've always wanted to do in my whole life, and now having the opportunity where uh, life has greased me with it, uh, that's what I'm going to do. So Are you ready? Fun. I'm super pumped. Big thumbs up, let's go, dude. Woo! <laughs>
<laughs> yeah, thank you. Good job. Oh. How was it? <laughs> you did it! Yeah, man. I, I, you know, I'm supposed to pretend like I had a good time, but like that was the scariest shit I've ever done in my life and like the most uncomfortable feeling. And like I like the ground and I don't like flying and I don't like skydiving, but this was fun to at least you know check off the bucket list and like I'm good. I'm so good. It's so tough. Um Okay, so the skydiving thing. That was way more intense than I anticipated. Like just from like a sensory perception or maybe like I'm just not an airbender. Like I definitely like the ground. Um, I kind of had the same experience when flying in like fighter jets. Like I just, I did not like it. A lot of people say like, oh, it's fun. You're lucky to have that experience. But like overall, like dude, that is, it is hard to like deal with the whole, uh, I don't know, like, uh, I'm fine being on the ground on the XY, but once you throw in that other axis and like in this case hurling downwards at 125 miles an hour, that's a lot of fun. But like in reality, like I'm a control freak and having it where I had to give up all control to do the tandem jump, it was, um, I don't know, it was different for me. I did not enjoy having that. And plus like I got a huge bruise on my inner thigh. It's not really a bruise, but it really is sore like from the opening. So I guess like the tandem harnesses aren't like the best for being able to have the comfort. So um, maybe I will do like a free fall in the future. But for right now, like I am a hard no. I do not want to skydive ever again. Like that was very much not um, what I'm trying to do with my life. And I never felt like afraid, uh, like something was going to happen. It just was not enjoyable experience. Like I guess some people can enjoy that, but I'm not the type of person to. I enjoy skating, doing crazy stuff like that, where I'm in control, so I'm not ruling it out, but I'm definitely not doing any free fall training to try to uh, get to somewhere that I'm not really trying to be at in my life, just because, like, I don't see, it just doesn't seem, the appeal isn't there, versus skating, like, it's definitely a lot more meditative, maybe it is, but, um, to be falling through the air, some people probably find brevity in that, but like for me like it was absolutely terrifying to be falling through the air at such a rate like it like just talking about it my hands are sweating like my, my feet uh, the whole thing like I was soaked in sweat afterwards and I'm really bad glad to be down on earth again and uh, yeah so hopefully hopefully you guys enjoyed watching me in pure terror and um, yeah Keep watching. Thank you.